And it makes sense for her to have the soul badge. I'm sorry that like I, I, I think that looked like 10 minutes or something. Yeah, now we're that by the Boy Scout who totally rips off my team because he has like Charmander and Squirtle. Now look, let's look at this guy. He has three things weak to Electric. So Gasly is a good idea. Yeah, I'm gonna say that. But then he does have that Diglett and that Magnemite. So oh, but he does have two things weak to Water too. So that makes me want to use Squirtle. But then he has that thing. Then he has the um, Magnemite, so I guess I have to use Cubone. And there I go through that stupid thing with my mouth. I can click. I hate doing that. It's such a bad habit. I need to break it. Like, seriously. Ugh. I know I don't do it too often in these videos, but I do it all the time. Like, out of them. <laughs> which, which I want to bring up, like, a good point. Like, uh, some people really bother me with that. Oh, crap. He dug a hole, and I forgot he's a ground type. Crud. Um, like... I don't know if you watch other people's videos on YouTube, but I, some people may wonder this: Is this how you act in real life? Yeah, it is. Like I, I make a good point to be like act like I do outside of these videos as I do in real life. So, I mean, I don't know. That's just something that kind of bothers me. People put on these personas on on their YouTube videos, like I'm this like guy that's super happy and super awesomely excited every second of the day. And in reality, I'm not always happy or excited or super, super duper 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 happy. Because that's just not the kind of person I am. Uh, second thought, I don't think Cubone's going to be all that useful. So I'm just going to use a Fire Blast and hopefully hit this Diglett. And uh, yes, strike your fighting pose, Diglett. I don't care. Because I don't want you to take down my Ghastly because he's going to be useful in this fight. So let's use it as a Fire Blast, which I find kind of weird. What is, why is this Cubone a Fire Blast? How's he even shoot? Oh, sweet, I got a burn. That's awesome. Oh, and that did that did over half. Diglett's not really known for its um really good defenses though. It has really good um attack and speed though. I really like Diglett. He's cool. Uh, I like ground types a lot, but some of them are just so stinking slow. It just makes me angry. And right, that fire blast should hopefully take down the Diglett. And yeah, it did. So I'm gonna celebrate by drinking some water. I mean, I gotta make sure to edit out all those water drinks because they're like. Oh, it's that's in my in my head how I think I drink water. I don't know if it really sounds like that. But luckily for me, he uses his magster, which sounds what is it? that sounds like something magster, huh? Like something from TV or something. I can't remember. You couldn't see it, but I was stroking my chin. Like, hmm, yes, magster. Where have I seen that name before? Hmm. Yes, yes. That's actually kind of surprising. I thought Bone Club would kill in one hit, but it didn't. It does alright damage, though. Oh my gosh, he's using Flash. What a butt move. It's going to lower my accuracy. That's annoying. I hate that. Ugh. As many people do. That's why there's another the uh, accuracy clause. Oh my gosh, seriously. And I have a good feeling he's going to lower my accuracy again. Come on, lo do it. Do oh yeah, you're, you're, that's, that's the kind of magster you are, apparently. I guess it kind of sounds like master. Like or something, I don't know. Just hit, hit, ah, oh, come on. Uh, I'm switching out. Uh, let's go to, let's go to Ghastly. I think Ghastly can, um, hurt him in some manner. Mega Drain will do, uh, neutral damage, which is better than doing nothing. It's better than you hit with another Flash, that's for sure. But I don't know if Flash will actually do anything to me since it's a normal move. I guess we'll see. Alright, did nothing. Cool. Maybe it will, maybe not, maybe it failed, and maybe it missed. I don't know. Um, let's see, S26. Um, Nightshade might actually be the better move to do here. Um, I'm pretty sure I'm faster, though. Yep, I am, alright! Because uh, if I Mega Drained, I would have full health, and he'd probably do an attack. So I'm going to try and Mega Drain next turn, just to get that 7 or 3 health back, which makes all the difference in the world. Eh, yeah, he has Thunderbolt. That's not cool. I mean, it's alright. I mean, it's better than having thunder, but... Or, it's better for the opponent to have thunder, because he might miss, but... Eh, yada yada yada. I'm, I'm blabbing on again. I'm blabbering. It's like the episode of Seinfeld, where they just go yada yada yada. I should do that in some of my episodes, just abridge the episode, because all I do is talk about, like, poop and corn for all the whole time. And yes, the magster falls apart. Mwahaha. <laughs> this is going to be a long recording session. I don't want to stop playing this game, honestly. I'm having so much fun. So nostalgic. I like the stadium, too. It looks really cool. I mean, it looks kind of kiddy, but I think that's kind of the point. Anyways, this uh, Thunder will 
take down this uh, Zubat, no problem. I almost caught him a Doug Trio. That's like the op that's like that's like the biggest opposite of Zubat, which be a Doug Trio. Anyways, something I always can I, I know I talk about this a lot, but something that really, really disturbs me: where the crud are Zubat's eyes? It just it just freaks me out. Like I'm kind of worried about him. What if he bumps into a wall? Like, I don't want that happening. I know he grows eyes when he turns into Zubat, so they have to be somewhere. Maybe they're just really, really tiny. Yeah, maybe. I always thought its ears were its eyes, but then again, you know, they hear, so... They hear really well. That's how they see, I guess. Oh, no, why, why am I talking about the anatomy of a Zubat, dang it? <laughs> Man, I have the worst random tangents ever. But alright, now they're perfect. Even though my guys kind of got beat up pretty hard. And now we're uh, going into the last two uh, badges here, the uh, Volcano and the Earth. Oh gosh, we're fighting a lass. And everybody knows lass is kick butt. Oh gosh, she's got some good Pokemon. Oh my gosh. Okay, so three things on... Okay, actually, let's think about it like this. She has the Vulpix the, and the three normal types, so Squirtle should be in there first. But she has that Pikachu, and I'm kind of scared of that Pikachu. So I'm going to throw a cube... No... If I throw a Bulbasaur in there, though, he'll actually, like, do... The Pikachu won't do as much, and I'll take down the Kabuto. But I'm pretty darn sure that Kabuto has Ice Beam. So, Ghastly isn't a bad idea, either. Because all the normal types won't be able to hit Ghastly. So that's... Yeah, that's my reasoning for doing that. And the music in the finals is always, like, really, like... Uh, it's always like, yeah! It's the finals, man! Welcome to the finals! You thought... You thought... You thought the stuff before was there anything... Welcome to the finals. Better get dumped on. Yeah. Bow to your sensei. Bow to your sensei! We're making so many Napoleon Dynamite references all of a sudden. I mean, watched that movie. Like, <laughs> recently. Or at all. Like, what the heck? And yeah, you're Thunderbolting going to do Jack Diddly Squat. To me. I always thought, like. Correct me if I'm wrong. Doesn't, like. Bulbasaur, like, reminds you kind of like a cabbage. Or something. Like, that's always really reminded me of. Like, some, like, really, like, good, like, veg -tea. Like a vegetable. veg -tea. Uh, but as should be expected, that Pikachu did paralyze me. Not that big of a deal, because Bulbasaur isn't really meant to be fast. He's really more defensive Pokemon. And, and that did good amount. I'm gonna try and use a Solar Beam. No, using a Solar Beam would be a bad idea. Let's try and use Leech Seed. I know it doesn't heal that much. Oh my gosh, he's gonna use Double Team. Seriously? That's the worst thing you can do in this game, dude. Do not... Just don't spam double team. Everyone hates that. That's just, that's just not cool. At least I seeded him, so he'll get like. Oh my gosh, it looks gross. It's like all nasty, and all the veins are just everywhere. But I leech seeded him, so no matter what, I don't even have to attack him, and I'll get health back. Seems to be using Thunderbolt re pretty regularly, though. So maybe he won't spam. Uh, it's double team move, which is a really good strategy, but at the same time, it's kind of cheating. <laughs> Eh, it's not really cheating, it's just not very cool. I couldn't have said it any better myself, Mr. Announcer. <laughs> but then again, I am paralyzed, which can nip me in the butt when I need to kill that Kabuto. Actually, didn't I bring someone else to kill Kabuto? I think I did. Yeah, I did. <laughs> uh, great. I got fully paralyzed. Paralyzed on the spot! Huh. Reminds me of, uh, I, like... I always heard that, like, right before, um, like, one of the last days of kindergarten, we had to do this, like, really long presentation, and I thought I was going to be so nervous. It wasn't, like, a serious presentation. It was, like, tell you what you learned, and we all just, we all had our individual letter, and mine was, like, X, and it was, like, it was just so weird. It was, like, everybody had to, like, we had this, like, stupid saying that you had to say, like, A for everyone, and blah, 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 yeah, no, E for everyone, especially you, and mine was, like, X, like, for extremely cool kids, or so, it was so stupid. And I heard like the the announcer say on the spot, and I was like, oh gosh, you know. So I actually knew what on the spot meant. Like I didn't want to like freak out and get all nervous and mess up. But no, I just I just said it, and it was all cool. It's kind of cool being like the last letter though. It's like I didn't have to do anything the whole time. I was kind of happy. Anyways, this Clefairy is gonna be a butt. I just know it is because that's so much health. Ugh. But, um, I do have Submission. I could use Toxic, but I'm kind of confused how Toxic works in the first generation of Pokemon. Because sometimes it'll do, like, really, like, bad damage, and then it'll do really good damage, so... Oh, great, I got a critical hit. Bye-bye, Clefairy. Oh, well, what? 
Come on! I got a super effective critical hit and it still lived. Uh, that shows you how good stinking Clefairy is. Ugh. I'm just going to finish it off with the uh, bite because I don't want to die of recoil damage. Yeah, Squirtle is actually a really good uh, Pokemon having Petite Cup. I highly recommend him. Anyways, yeah, just go just go cry your Gengar mother. Nah, I'm not going to make that like a joke. One episode was enough, dang it. Don't be, don't be doing that every time. What's your last Pokemon? Jigglypuff! Ah, that's annoying. I have nothing to kill Jigglypuff, really. Uh, I'm going to take the risk and just use sus Submission. Try and kill myself. Or, okay, good, I'm faster. All right. And not kill myself. And look, it has 101 health. That's almost like... Oh, well, it has crappy defense, so either way. And yeah, the Jigglypuff won't even get to attack. <laughs> ah, but Squirtle, you did you did not get, you did not die in vain, even though you didn't really die. Anyway, I'm going to try and use Ghastly here. Try and... Eh, I don't want... Does Nightshade actually work on normal types in this generation? I'm not sure. Uh, I guess now's a good time to try. Why not? Hmm. I'm pretty, I have a pretty good idea that it does. I feel like it does. Um, yay! Alright, it does. That's that's something good to, to make note of. Oh my gosh, it used rest. Oh my gosh, I hate Jigglypuffs. Dang it. That makes me angry. And it made me so angry I drank some water. I know there's been like a lot of like random pauses in my videos, but you really want to hear me like... <laughs> like sneeze like 50 feet in the air or something. That's just that's I never like hearing that, so I so I edit them out of my videos. When it wakes up though, I want to try and use confuse ray. I think that'll be a good strategy. Because you know when you're really confused, you're you're, less, you're basically half as effective as you should be. I mean you can switch out and get rid of the confusion, but it's her last Pokemon, so she can't. Ah, oh, come on, it woke up. I feel, I feel like it's gonna sleep again.